Just get crazy. Do like that, like magic wand. You're throwing a spell. Fine, take it. Got it. My buddy Erica what? is joining me over. No, not that high. Different high. <laughs> they they wouldn't be included. That would be Bowie and Moo in the background. Erica's little fuzz, fuzz babies. Security. Security too. Okay. So we're working on a project today. Yeah, you're going to need some risers eventually. Hmm. I'll just but take it off of those. You want to take it off of that? I have a plan. I'm hoping this will work. And this is also a non sticky zone, right? after I get the shirt out. So we're at Rhonda, Rhonda, I see I screwed it up right there. Rhonda Draculis's place, RK3 Designs. And I thought we would do something that would be kind of fun. And I'm hoping, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. Yes! Now you see where I'm going? Wait a minute, it'll be uh, mm -hmm. mirrored. Okay, hmm, let's see. Think, 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 think. It is not going to show up that way. Hold, oh, please. Okay, plan B. So I got a piece of paper and we are going to trace this out so that way we can do a flip of. It's going to bleed through. That's why it's your shirt. So, don't worry about it, and let's just go for it. And then what we're going to do is a doodle on one of her, Erica's uh, cradle boards. Nope. Acrylic panels. Nope. Acrylic pouring panels. Yeah. That sounds good. And then do a resin pour on top of it. I'm gonna in the shot really well. Please. And bear in mind if you do this over um, the shirt like we're doing, it's gonna bleed on the shirt. We know this. We're buying the shirt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're just ad living it at the moment. I'm gonna steal. Winging it. Yep, that too. Alright. The chalk one I'm putting back in. Or so I'm putting this right into the sticky zone, which is good. That's what we call it at home. We call it the sticky zone. Mm. No, this is not as easy as it looks. You got this. Even if you want to just do RK3, that might work too. It's like when you stand back and look, you can see through it, and then when you get up close to do it, it kind of disappears on you. Way disappears. Might be better just to do the letters themselves and not do the outline. So I did something similar to this on those little ornaments. Remember those little clear ornaments that you had available? Mm -hmm. I did some uh, doodles and designs on some of those clear ornaments and then uh, did resin on top of them. They turned out really pretty. You got it. Ta-da. Rough. So we'll just get Jeff to doodle on that. Yeah. You can, <laughs> can fix this for me later. Alright, so. That works. Like so. Sweet. Yeah, just make sure when you do it, 
it still reads right. All right. Do you want to do yours first or do you want me to do mine first? I don't know, go for it. Okay, since we don't know what the plan is. Okay. <laughs> Move my booty out of the way. Alright, now what to do, what to do, what to do. I'm gonna see a couple colors. Like all of them. Go for it, go for it. Gonna be impossible to center. Yep. Okay. What? Blurbed out. I'll make the blurb work. Do some intentional blurbs. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Actually, that gave me an idea. What is that technique that's called that they do tattoos in that has that speckled kind of look in the background and also a little bit of abstract in there and it's kind of what that's reminding me of going towards. They do a lot of watercolor looking tattoos now. That's true. There's a certain style that that's called that I'm trying to remember and it's gonna to come to me after we're done. Yours all beautiful and refined, and I'm like, let's splatter all the colors. Ah, there goes a blob. <sighs> Not alone. Nope. Blobs all happen. Copper, you doing? Jeff would just get here so he can do it. Oh, you are handicapped so badly with Jeff. Just I Jeff am. to the rescue. Here's the thing: why should I know how to do it if he knows how to do it? Mm-hmm. And he gets so mad, and I'm like, "Can you just do it?" And he's like, "No, you know how to do. You can do the things." I have never debated the fact that I can do them. My point is. I don't have time to do them and you already know how to do them. So if I take out however many hours of my day mm -hmm. to learn it. But but it's coming out of your comfort zone. Learning a new thing is a good thing. Isn't that what your channel's all about? I am just saying. <laughs> She's gonna flick that copper at me. <laughs> this looks like platinum rose. Like I wouldn't call this copper. Thank you. Um, I got a big blob in the middle. Okay. I'm just gonna add to add more blobbies. Mm -hmm. So what I'm saying is, I don't mind learning and knowing how to do it myself. But if I have a commission and also 90 hundred orders, and you know how to do it, why okay. should I stop other productive things? True. 
Commission, I, you got my back on that one. Okay. Like, I want to learn how to hair brush, brush, for example. Like, if someone orders a lip piece, I always ask him to do the teeth because it takes him 17 seconds and it looks amazing. Yes. Okay. I, for me to do that. 100% agree with you. 100%. But I when you're playing. Maybe because I'm vicious. No, because you got a marker like right at my eyeballs. <laughs> the only reason why. Here, get some of that aggression out. Flick it. Which one were you flicking where you're getting the black? Uh, probably that one. The big one? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. But I'm going to switch out for your copper. Just get crazy. Do like that, like magic wand. You're throwing a spell. Fine, take it. Got it. That's how I do my, the all color lips. Yes. Most of the color application is this. Flicky. Now you can get directional and like flick it like that. I'm gonna stand back. But if you go like this, you're gonna. If I have... get her piece on the wall, she's going to shoot me. Shut and she has the guns to back me up here. I'm gonna shoot her. I'm just saying, this is one of my favorite application techniques. There. I did a bunch of it takes downwards no effort. Strikes. Down there, I mean it. Hey, here we go. <laughs> you messed it up. Now you gotta do it again. No, dang it. Okay. So we're clearly gonna have to pause a little bit so it can dry. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna pause for a moment. BRB. Be right back. She's there clearly not dead. One more. Good. And not done. Uh -huh. She's just kidding. It's fine. Sure? No, but no. yes. No, yes? Okay. Man, just sure. kidding! <laughs> And now you're just undone. I'm not, I'm not done. I'm not done. I go to heat it up and it's like, nope, nope, not done. You're like, I want to do it something else, right? There. Mm -hmm. You know the problem. I know you do. Oh, she's getting fancy with her leaves. Nah. <laughs> you got cross hatchies. I did get cross hatchy. I have nothing on the top. Here we go. Good enough. Done. Maybe. <laughs> Probably done. All right. See my hot mess of the piece. See the metallics better there. Here's Erica's hot mess of the piece. They're both fun. It's gonna be amazing. They have attitude. And if anybody can appreciate attitude in a piece, it's Rhonda. Alright. Now we're gonna work on the resin. You wanna do the um, Erica kit since we have it out? Sure. Why not? Because they're gorgeous. Oh, we use that for the beads. That's right. Mm -hmm.
All right, we're using Stone Coat Art Coat Resin. And it's already been out for a little bit, mainly because Erica used it for another project. And we had stuff left over. So, of course, we got to use it up. Waste not, want not. Mm -hmm. I think that's enough. So this is uh, Erica and Jeff's kit that Color Passion put together. And, um, oh, link in the description for a coupon code for Ours Till Death site. But if you haven't heard before, she got engaged. I've been trying to keep it real low key though. I say without that ring, but sticky, you know, bad idea. I've got the ring on me. It's on you. Yep, definitely. For this resin to be this warm, we mixed it a while ago. Mm-hmm. Do we want a big cup to put the dirty porn into? Why don't you just use the original cup? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna start laying our room. Just why not? I think we'll have enough to do a dirty pour. Uh, if anything, I'll Especially get it started. Since we didn't grease the pan. What are you thinking? I was just gonna do just application, but we can do a dirty pour. Get in there. We don't have much time to think about it. Nope. Not much time. I know I'm still gonna pour in my uh, glitter afterwards, so if you're okay with that, I'm gonna leave that glitter out. And just Absolutely. apply it before I tilt it. What? Absolutely. So these are acrylic rounds that we're using that Erica also has on her site. But the cool thing about them is they have this paper on both sides. You peel off one side, you do your pour on it, you wait till it cures, then you peel off your back, drips come off, all done. No cleanup. Yes, we like a no cleanup. Gorgeous color. Yes. They did good with both of these. Purple my fave though. Sorry. <laughs> but this is not too bad. It's not. I think my absolute favorite color is that deep purple by Just Resin. Deep purple is a good color. It mm, four. I was looking around these to get there. It's not. They are party. Uh oh, they stopped off Daiquiri Place. That explains it. Did they bring us back one? They better do. I hope so. If you're watching, which I know you're not, it's not live. Rhonda, bring us a Daiquiri. Dead gummit. Strawberry, please. Or peach. Mm. Alright. Go. Mm -mm. Go. Okay. Let me know when you think it's half. Well, I think you're past half. Oh shoot. But go for it. Go. One of these days I'm gonna bring out my extra one for you to mess with. Your extra one? Yeah, I got an extra one of that brand. My other one seems to be holding out pretty good. Keep no. moving. It's kept up. All right, I'm doing a big old glitter swipe. Because why not? Yeah, I'm gonna hit it up again. Mm -hmm. I'm letting as much as I can drip out. No, that's actually not about it. Whoop. We're starting to get string cheese.
All that's going to end up getting tilted off anyway. Mm -hmm. This looks so much like an acrylic pour, it's kind of tripping me out a little bit. I love the cups because they kind of look planet-like and you never know what they're going to do. You get those happy surprise sales. I'm used to the camera being to the left and to the right of me. So when I tilt, it works. <laughs> So the uh, glitter in this kit is also chameleon-like and it'll shift between the green and the purple. Also very pretty glitter. <gasps> I don't want to do that. What'd you do? I was going to like create something for the colors to flow over, but you're not going to be able to see that. Mm -hmm. Then it'll just make it all just regular. Mm -hmm. Not the best idea. We're hoping we have enough resin. It's going to tilt it around till it gets all over. Look at that. That's why it shows up on the other side. Yeah, it's not. You know, we could have just put solid mermaid glitter on. Where? On the entire thing? Yeah. True, but... True. But true. But... <laughs> I wanted to play with the colors! Oh, that was a little whiny. Sorry. That's fair. <laughs> it's okay, you can be whiny. You're in the presence of another whiner. Got fingers. Like literally. It's gonna happen. This heating and rotating, and heating and rotating, and heating and rotating. Rinse and repeat. Almost covered. <laughs> just, just, just go. <laughs> just go. Just, just flow. I hear Jeff. Beware of the Jeff. Yeah, I know. Get him. Get him, beans. I'm glad we covered up the design already so mm -hmm. Ron can't know it. Hey. Just letting you know, we're recording. So now they know. No, that no, that no, was talk the... away. Oh, Y'all brought a cake. I literally just said, wait that a minute. The first time I got Please tell me there's yeah. more of a cake than that. Nope, this is it. Oh my 
gotta figure out what this is. This is it. Put 30 candles on these. I'm more concerned with where my daiquiri is, so. Oh, we didn't even stop by it. Yeah, I bet you didn't. Except for did. Then is it even a Copenhagen? Hi. Mmm. Here. Never mind, I think I already know mm. what the cake looks like. <laughs> it's a can like of skull. Mm-hmm. It looks like a groom's cake at a wedding. What, well, not going to do the red velvet armadillo cake that's probably been done a million times? Take a whack at weed. Um, hmm. She's recording? You're recording. I know. <laughs> May have to do a slight bit of editing there. get a good coat on it. And we're gonna let that sucker cure up. Did you guys go find the pokies? It took a little while. Well, we had to go to that place, and then there was a wreck. Then there was a wreck? Oh, my gosh. Well, we got the good end of the wreck. Yeah. The other people going the opposite way? Not so much. Yeah, they were. Mm -hmm. Pat Jack. Burped. Okay, next day we're going to do reveal. We're both a little sleepy and groggy, so bear that in mind. I'm trying to get my finger under the paper. I think that's the hardest part is getting it started. Mm -hmm. I'm just so loving the no cleanup. Mm -hmm. Big gnarly drips going away. Okay, Cujo. He's all excited this morning. Yes, he's very hyped today. If I heated it first, it would have probably been easier. Yep, definitely looks better than I thought it would. With how thick it was setting up. Mm-hmm, always good. <laughs> I was getting worried. It was a bit of a challenge. I'm trying to do it all nice and gracefully. Right. That turned out fun. Settle down. That's enough. All right, swap. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, let me get started. That's the fun part. When we're at home, I just use an exacto blade. I don't have any. <laughs> I guess the hardest part is for me is getting this getting it started. Mm -hmm. Filling that stuff up is almost that so satisfying. Mm hmm. You should do a dirty pull with tints on a clear thing because you know it would do that like sink through look. Ooh. That was looking. Why do we always try to do it where it gets off the moon feel? I don't know. But nobody knows. It seems to be a universal thing. So, 
Eric and I would just heat it up with a little bit of heat on the resin if it's being a little tricky. Mm -hmm. But how fun! Definitely could see the metallics at an angle. Mm hmm. Cool. Done. You know, say any goodbyes or anything before I stop it. Well, then get over here and say goodbyes. You say goodbyes. If I do it, the boys will get worked up. Uh, Erica's in the background. I'm doing True. an Erica face. She uh. does. Claire, y'all, check out her Arch Till Death. That's where I get all my supplies for resin. Check out Rhonda Jacuzzi's oh. place. Oh my God! I'm <laughs> well, you're not on camera. Did you say hi? You just turned it. Did you? I did. Okay. Hi guys. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. No. Get Check out RK3 Designs if you're interested in any kind of resin work countertops. She is the queen. She knows her stuff. See them all back there. And then check out my Etsy store. Buy some stuff. And Amazon stuff. store. I'll see you guys later. Later, y'all. Bye. <laughs>